Hi everybody, uh, my name is Matthew. Uh, I'm just here to do a quick review on the uh, 12 South Magic Wand. As uh, you can see, I've got installed right here on the, my Apple wireless keyboard and Apple wireless trackpad. So yeah, I'm just going to run through uh, the setup of the Magic Wand and also uh, just give uh, you my own personal opinions on whether it's actually worth the uh, quite hefty price tag for what it is. Um, so here we go. Right, so this is how uh, the Magic Wand looks when it's uh, been put together with the wireless keyboard and Magic Trackpad. Uh, the Magic Wand itself comes uh, complete with this tube-like uh, system. It's uh, made of plastic, which is a bit of a shame. You would hope that it would be made of metal like uh, the Apple components themselves, but sadly not. But nonetheless, it does have the same colour and same uh, style, same finish as the Apple uh, components. As you can see on the bottom, if I just hold it up to the camera, uh, it has a similar uh, plastic feet to stop any scratches to uh, whatever you've got this rested on. Oh, it's just a nice feature. But one of the nicest features that Magic South have done for us are these uh, dividers that they've included with the Magic Wand. Uh, we've got this main H bar that runs straight down the middle here to connect uh, a seamless, to make it, well, to make it seamless between the Magic Trackpad and the wireless keyboard itself. And then they've even added this uh, small uh, silicon plastic, uh, just separate like filler, just which uh, just slots in there which is nice for them because it just uh, means that no dust is going to get in there or anything like that. Right, so now I'll just show you the assembly of the product. Right, so this is the main component, the uh, plastic circle cylinder uh, with the rubber feet. Uh, first things first, you've got to make sure that the 12 South logo that you can see uh, just there is facing away from the direction of the slant. So if I just lay that there, first of all, if you take wireless keyboard, and simply uh, just place it on top, right at the edge, and that will just clip in. Simple as. Then you take your H-bar, uh, the long plastic one, just uh, slide that onto the keyboard, and easy as so. Then you take a wireless trackpad, slot that in as so, and then slide that across to meet the H-bar. Now you can see right there we've got that seam, seamless, so it runs straight away across. Then you take the small plastic divider, and uh, simply insert front ways first and uh, once that's in you just might sometimes have to just slide the H bar down just a bit just to give it enough room now that's in we are all in place I will just note make sure that you turn on uh, both the uh, keyboard and magic trackpad before you put them in because once you're in you can't actually access uh, the keyboard power switch which is a bit annoying but uh, using the energy saving function that Apple have included it's not that much of an issue uh, and vice versa if you're a lefty and you're having the trackpad on the other side so there we go that's uh, the assembly done it takes a matter of seconds um, so yeah right then so you've seen what it looks like and you've seen how it goes together now for my uh, personal opinion verdict um, Probably like me, it looks good, it feels good, and it's ideal if you're working from your lap. Uh, just when I've got my uh, MacBook plugged in to my big TV, um, and being able to do everything while sitting from uh, the sofa is ideal, and it's just very easy when doing this. A couple of downsides I must mention. Um, some people have mentioned issues of when using the Magic South, that the click function using the feet of the Magic Trackpad get lost. Uh, I haven't had such said issues yet, but uh, I'm yet. I only got this today and put it together this afternoon, so I'm yet to really uh, work it in and use it properly. So I will uh, see if that is an issue that will come for me. But I've heard mixed reviews whether that actually happens or not, or whether it's just people putting it together wrong. Um, as for price tag, uh, at the moment currently Amazon I've got this on sale. I picked this up for I believe sixteen ninety nine instead of the thirty ninety nine price tag, which I believe most uh, retailers are selling it for. Um, so for that price, I think it is worth it. It is very handy. It does uh, clear up things on your desk, everything like that. But for the uh, 30 99 price tag, uh, I would question whether it's worth that for a piece of plastic um, and a piece of silicon. So that's my review of the 12 South uh, Magic Wand. I uh, hope this has helped, uh, and thanks for watching.